It is Thirsty Thursday time. Now, if you're looking for a cozy spot for a nice fall cocktail, Javelina in Portland St. John's neighborhood is the place to be. Yeah, Javelina just opening up last year. Oh, there you go. Yeah, uh -huh. a little merch. I like the yeah, color scheme, too. Yeah, get the merch So in we're there. serving up some cocktails, but with a twist. So joining us in studio now to tell us more about the menu, the vibes, we have co-owners Ezra Holbrook and Red Ray Fraser. Good morning to you both. Good morning. Hey, guys. Thanks, thanks for having us. Awesome yeah, to so have you here. here. Yeah. Okay, so if uh, maybe, you're, maybe you recognize the voices or maybe just the music in the background that we've been playing because the Decemberists and Portugal the man in the house with these two so pretty cool to have uh, these two in in the house here now we're talking about a collab between you two but not a musical collab we're talking bar collab you're co-owning this bar why where did this come from well it, it's born of our musical collabs uh, Ezra and I have our own careers uh, and uh, we've come together about uh, well about 20 years ago I guess and um, uh, and we, we still like each other. <laughs> wow. I would certainly hope so. <laughs> no small feat in yeah. both the, the music and the restaurant world, you know? Absolutely, no. absolutely. Yeah, we make such great music together. We we could reopen a bar. I love it. <laughs> that is so cool. I mean, I, I can only imagine how many good songs over the years have been written and crafted at good bars. So what, <laughs> what kind of vibe, what kind of atmosphere did you want to create here with Javelina? Yeah, Javelina is sort of a cocktail forward, um, kind of intimate little neighborhood bar. Mm -hmm. um, if you're familiar with St. John's, you know it's got a ton of great restaurants and bars. Oh, yeah. Um, we tried to kind of like pick a vibe that sort of set us a little bit apart. We didn't really want to compete with anybody. We want to sort of add something to the neighborhood. So we felt that maybe kind of something that was a little more like a date night, kind of a little more intimate. We don't have any TVs, so it's a great place to like come and chat. That's yeah. cool. Um, we share, um, our food program is provided by Beto's Taqueria, so we have a food truck outside. There's no kitchen in the Ooh. building, so we had to get a little creative. Who doesn't love tacos? Um, yes. I mean, yeah, seriously, that's, 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 that's a Perfect. great bar yeah. accompaniment. Absolutely. So it's, yeah, hopefully a good night to come with a date. You can dress up and feel comfortable or you can dress down and still feel comfortable. It's not pretentious, but it's you can you can go cute. you can go Portland business casual from yeah. time to time. The yeah. yeah. most important go. thing is it's it's a safe space for everyone. You know, everyone is respected and uh, you know, good vibes all around. Nice, yeah. I love Fantastic. that. Enjoy your time when you're out there. Well, and we've got your we've got your guide to some good cocktails this morning. So what are we shaking up today? Uh, we're gonna do I think one of our prettiest drinks, which is a blackberry lemon drop. Ooh. Um, and then also we are gonna do a mocktail. We offer a bunch of mocktails, as most people in Portland know now. Mm -hmm. Having non-alcoholic options is really important. Um, so we have a bunch of mocktails actually on our menu. Um, and then we also offer some things like CBD sodas and um, non-alcoholic beers and stuff like that. Nice. nice. Plenty of options. Yes. All right. Well, uh, I'll just Shall pepper I? you guys with questions as you're mixing away okay. here. Uh -huh. So what was the general, I guess, when you talk about the vibe and like that, you know, that, that safe space, that ambiance, the no TVs, I mean, why was that the approach you wanted to go with? Well, you know, Ezra and myself, our, our lives are pretty busy. And yeah. we wanted a place where you could walk into and just feel totally Cool. And uh, and we figured we weren't alone in that. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. uh, and uh, was, uh, originally, I think <laughs> the thought was to not have uh, music, but we are musicians, so. <laughs> <I was> like, <laughs> yeah, that lasted for like a week. Right, yeah. right. You're yeah. like, I'm itching. No more music than you. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, absolutely. Oh, I, I don't want to disturb you guys. I know, so you, oh, I, no. I noticed Ezra was kindly waiting to, to shake the, <laughs> to shake up the shakers. You got the ice in there, but that's what you got to get for the, uh, you know, the froth, totally. the drink, the mix. And then what, cold what is the, uh -huh. the name Javelina? Where does that come from? Actually, it's a Pixies song off of the record Bossa Nova. Um, oh. I don't know why, but uh, Javelina is kind of small and intimate, and, Haveli and the song Javelina is this cute sort of surf rock song that they do. And oh, for nice. some reason, when I walked in there, we had a list of like 40 terrible names. <laughs> <laughs> and I walked in and I just was like, ooh, Havelina. And it just, everyone was like, yep, that's the one. That's the one. It's I've been denied every single. Off. Off. <laughs> it does, yeah. it does roll the tongue. I thought maybe you guys were just big fans of, you know, the Havelina pigs in like Southwest Arizona. <laughs> yeah. you know? well, fans, yeah. fans of them too. Yeah, but, just big yeah. nature lovers. No. <laughs> that so, is really pretty. This is the blackberry lemon drop. It's just blackberries and uh, fresh lemon juice and a little vodka. Ooh, look at that. Wow, um, gorgeous. Normally we would uh, put a little sugar rim on there for you. Yeah, but okay, I, didn't, okay. I didn't know how many props I would be able to work with. <laughs> well, you gotta go, for the, go to the yeah, bar. See, we we keep it simple in the morning, you yeah, know, we're just getting warmed up. And although our, our bar is intimate and cozy, um, it's, it's part of a bigger picture. Um, you know, as mentioned, we do music almost nightly. We have different events going on, uh, karaoke, uh, trivia nights, but uh, uh, we're also part of the St. John Saunter, mm -hmm. which uh, occurs every Saturday uh -huh. from 12 to 5, and um, it's all participating bars in, in St. John's, and uh, uh, you can buy a ticket um, from Javelina, $5, mm -hmm. and nice. you can uh, go and, and have a 
drink at, uh, at the participating bars. Sip and savor your way through St. Yes. John's. Yeah. I, I, I love that. I will say, Such too, fun neighborhood. the neighborhood is so cute and charming. And it, I mean, it is one of the neighborhoods in Portland that definitely looks different now compared to years ago. And mm -hmm. like, I love the way the community is embracing yeah. that pocket yeah. of Portland. Yes, it's yes. really cool. Yeah, yeah. it's a great neighborhood. It, yeah. it really is. Yeah. Absolutely. OK, well, we're, we're going to wait until a little later in the morning to try the hard <laughs> stuff. But I'm, I'm going to give this zero proof a try. Yeah, that's the Havelina Palmer. No oh, alcohol. Oh, gosh, I love that's that. That's my favorite, by the way. Is it your favorite? Really? Okay. Yes, it no is. Pressure. So what's what's this mocktail? Yeah, that's a mocktail. It's um, it's actually got Ooh. a bunch of stuff in it, which I'm glad I got to make it ahead of time. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> um, it's uh, so red. Nice. It's a red tea that's a combination of a couple different tea, uh, iced teas that we use. Oh. Um, it's got some non-alcoholic bitters in it. It's mm -hmm. got lots of good stuff in it. It's layered. Um, it's awesome. complex. You do feel like you're enjoying a nice cocktail, you exactly. know, and not just a Shirley Dimple. Well, how so, about it? Yeah. Cheers to that. That's what we love to see with the Zero Proof menu. Hey, if you want to check out their cocktails, the vibe, all the good things happening in St. John's, Havelina on Lombard Street in Portland, St. John's neighborhood. Learn more at javelinapdx.com. Uh, thank you both for being here. Cheers. Have a lot of fun. Congrats on the opening. Everybody.